Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Oopsies. Oopsie. Sorry about that. <laughs> Everyone's asking me to call you. Oh, it always asks. Always, always ask me too. Oh, really? Am I supposed to give it the worst? I I just feel like mine are bad. Like, well, the the video, oh, the God. call, the call was good. Cool. It's all good on top stuff. So. <laughs> hey, um, introduce yourself to uh, my uh, YouTube people. Oh, okay. Uh, what's up, guys? My name is Scott. Um, just along for the ride with me. And pleasure to actually be riding in the snow. Finally, it's a <laughs> right. pleasure to see the snow. <laughs> right on. Yes, instead of the flooding rains that we had on Valentine's. And where do you work, Scott? I work at Peppercorn. Uh, currently, uh, I uh, actually have an interview tomorrow morning. <laughs> so you, so you, so you might be getting a job at at Verizon, huh? Damn, yeah, dude. Keep my fingers crossed. Huh? No, well, I'm, I'm, I'm obviously happy for you to freaking work wherever. But the yeah. fact that you wait, wait tables at like the nicest restaurant in town is like yeah. that's like the like the most lucrative job almost there. It's, like, it's hard when your boss is not nice. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that's all I gotta say about that one. But, yeah. Uh, no. No. I'm looking for. Please, because I get thousands of views. So yeah. 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 No, I'm, look, <laughs> I'm looking for benefits and full time. And Well, well. <laughs> speaking of Verizon, my my choices to switch this phone in are between Boost and Verizon. Jeff's trying to get me to. Oh, uh, is he? But I need to make sure that my live feeds will actually. This isn't live right now, uh -huh. but like uh, that my live feeds will work all over town. Yeah. Uh, because I pretty much have to stay with this ATT in the same area all the time, oh. and it just sucks. So like, yeah, if you make it to if you go out to my house, then you won't get ten percent, right? Yeah. So, Trying to go wide, not probably the, uh, exactly. One but like one. driving through this area, it's always good. good. So like, yeah, yeah. So like, uh, right now you're good. yeah. But since we're recording, I can I can record anywhere, obviously, because I don't need any cell. And then you upload later. Cell service, then I upload later. Yeah. Wow. No. Um, yeah, I really didn't. I didn't like we were talking earlier. And you said we were probably gonna get like a couple inches or so or three on foot. Right. Well, up to like it, up it? to a half a foot, and yeah, dude, in parts of town over by like Boulder Bay, they already have six, eight, eight inches. Parts of Upper Moon Ridge, almost a foot already, dude. Really? Yeah, bro, it's insane right oh, now. Oh wow. Yeah, it's totally nuts out there. As you can see, it's just yeah, it's just crazy. All right, guys, sorry about that. We're back with Scott. What's up? My I'm good, for the ride. good buddy, yeah, my old yeah. boss. <laughs> yeah, he's an old friend. Well, still friends. Yeah, friends, <laughs> friends. friends. Well, friend. <laughs> but was like yeah. my superior. <laughs> I know a lot of people don't like being called like their boss, but no, like yeah, Jeff, but but Jeff, I have a lot of respect for this guy, man. Oh, diligent, you. diligent worker, and uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Just sure. trying to make it mine. <laughs> right on, bro. So guys, we are in Big Bear Lake at the moment. We're in Moon Ridge and we're headed to, to Irwin. We're gonna take this guy home. First, we're gonna make a stop in Sugarloaf. But I want you guys to see what it's like in town. My driveway, as you guys saw, has about six inches of snow deep. Um, so it's, uh, that was about right, yeah? Yeah, yeah, about six inches. So it's it's happening. And if I don't take the phone off this, it's gonna overheat. Because, oh, look at there's an accident over there. That sucks, I hope everyone's okay. Oh, wow. Alrighty. Jeez. Those Alright, so let's do this here. Now we don't have to have it on as hot since so that piece of ice melted. Finally. Finally. Wow, these conditions are crazy. Dude, isn't it gorgeous though? Yeah. It's just, just magnificent. It's and nice. look, we're gonna make fresh tracks right here. Look at that. Wow. Look at that. It's so pretty, man. Like it sure <laughs> is, especially without any of the uh, a lot of the flatlanders are gone too, you know. Yeah. I mean, probably a lot of them are still up here for the three-day holiday. Yeah. But, you know. But they're like, they're... But the, we, we appreciate them, too. Oh, yeah. Big, I love well, having, you know. Well because, we, well, 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 because we can't live here without them. Oh, yeah, definitely. I, I just... They pay our freaking salaries up here. Without them, right. we have absolutely nothing. Oh, yeah. For, for the peppercorn, we were just... We're booked this week. We've been booked this whole past weekend and next weekend. So, we are already booked for... Dude, I'm, hey guys, when when you come up here and eat at Peppercorn, 
please, please, please ask for Scott to be your server. Yes. And uh, tip the hell out of him. <laughs> <laughs> we are a traditional steakhouse. Dude, look so. at the snow, Scott. Oh my god. Sorry, dude. Yeah, so they are a what? A traditional yeah. steakhouse. Oh, okay. Yes. okay. Yeah, so all American menu. Definitely. It's so um, good. I love their food. It's yeah. so good. Tons of, uh, we have all, all sorts of wines. We do offer a full bar, you know, everything like that. So. Dude, heck yeah, man. Uh, heck yes. Yeah, I don't think my truck would have made it home. Dude, okay, Scott's got like the coolest truck in town, but for some <laughs> reason. It, it's, a two, it's a 2004 Chevy Silverado, but it is a two-wheel drive, and it is a lifted truck, keep in mind. So, uh, it fishtails like crazy, and it does not do good in the snow. <laughs> dude, hey, just, just, uh, if this guy's truck had four-wheel drive, dude, it's, it's the sickest truck up here. It's a badass truck. Yeah, yeah, it's a badass truck, dude. <laughs> but it just, it's for sure. It's yeah. a silver truck. Yeah. <laughs> So, dude, someone from my YouTube channel just sent me forty dollars through a through Venmo, and it said for gas. Oh, really? dude, I think that that said Jesse. I'm gonna stop this video real quick so I can check it out, and then thank you, and then I and and and, and then I'm gonna make you your own video like I usually do for all of you who give me donations. Guys, thank you. I I, I mean, That's awesome. oh, dude, Great. they they are so amazing to me. Good, the, these guys good. treat me with such love and respect, Scott. That's awesome. That's what I like to hear. Yeah, so, 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 like, Scott, like, like, I'm not trying to, like, I want someone who knows me, who would be honest with me, to, like, tell them, like, what kind of person you, you think I am, without being full of shit, like, like, uh, because I, you know. Honestly, Nick, you are, the, you are honestly, you still are, um, one of the most truthful, loyal, diligent person that I know, honestly. Dude, that's nice. And, um, I couldn't thank you enough for honestly, uh, being the person that you are. <laughs> um, no, I'm saying that from the bottom of my heart, because honestly, I, uh, there's not too many people out there like you. And, um, you know, if we could, uh, definitely fill the world with 500 billion nicks, that's what it would be all about. And uh, I just appreciate you being uh, truthful and loyal, and you know, you're a very down to earth guy. Scott, we appreciate it. Thank you, man. all of us viewers, too. Yeah, <laughs> so guys, thank you. Say hi to Scott. Thank you. That's What's Scott, up? guys. Dude, Scott's coolest. Dude, that was. That was <laughs> Did you hear what he just said about me? <laughs> guys, guys, guys. Yeah, here, so cash, cash that check that I Oh, thanks. Ca cash it later. Okay. okay. Oh, shit, did I say that on the no, camera? There's no money needed for words of exchange, honestly. Those are truthful words, and I didn't even need money for it. Guys, guys, so, yeah, that's that's Scott. I, I appreciate Pleasure you, Scott. Pleasure to meet you, all of you. And I, I'm going to pause this for a second. Guys, it looks like we're driving warp speed through all the snow coming through the car. It's so awesome. It's so cool watching this. Anyway, I love you guys. Hang on. All right, guys. Sorry about that. I, I just had to check something. And then when I get home, I'm going to make the video for the donor who just sent $40 via Venmo just now. I need to see who it is. Thank you so much, you guys. Seriously, you guys truly, truly are my heart and soul. And you guys really do allow me to feel good and comfortable in my own skin because a lot of times I feel down and out on shit and you guys really 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 allow me to feel good about myself and uh, that's the greatest compliment I can ever give anybody thank you guys so much for always being there for me and I'm glad I can bring joy or something to your guys lives like uh, something different um, you know out of the ordinary just a novel this is very novel <laughs> you know so um, yeah so we still got Scott with us we're just gonna stop by my friend Kevin's house real quick um, and then I'm gonna take Scott home. He lives in out in Irwin, so you guys are, are are gonna get to see parts of Irwin again. But obviously, due to privacy, I'm gonna shut off the video before we get to his house, of course. But um, but uh, yeah, guys, I just want you guys to just uh, know that I do care about you a lot, and um, you guys have been so supportive of me, just emotionally and fiscally, and, and I'm I'm super super grateful for you guys for that. Um, you show me that humanity truly truly does have a soul in itself so thank you very very much you guys oh yeah these guys are doing donuts in the parking lot look at look at these guys charging Woo. oh darn it come on do some more do right. one there we go there you go <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh dude oh, oh that's fun yeah totally man 
totally with all this snow so up here in parts of Sugarloaf I heard they already have eight or nine inches that's what my other friend said right well, yeah 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 I think that's what he said yeah that's that's crazy and this guy Mickey Avalon <laughs> <laughs> I only know that one song too. <laughs> the, the My Dick song. Oh, yeah, I remember that song. That was an old song. Yeah, man, totally. Yeah. It's funny. Alright, what is going on up here? This guy better not be going right. Not, it's not going to matter because I'm just going to go whichever way he's not. Yes. Wow, look, it looks like they got about eight inches so far up here. Is it? That guy looks like he wanted to go right. I know, huh? Woo! Oh, yeah. Just know I'm doing that on purpose. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, for right. sure. I don't want you to think oh, that. No. I, I, I would never put you in freaking jeopardy like that, dude. I, I, I don't put loved ones in jeopardy like that. Uh, my friend Tyler, he drives like a 99 Jeep Cherokee and he flies around in that thing. <laughs> Dude, wow. look at how deep it is. It looks way deeper over here. Guys, that's like eight, nine inches. He's right, huh? Yeah. Guys, that is really deep. And the further we go this way, the deeper it, it, it's going to get because the higher in elevation we're going. Pretty amazing. That is really good. Yeah, that's amazing, huh? That's that's definitely the deepest I've seen it this season. Oh, yeah. And, guys, it's like a champagne powder, too. It's nice, huh? Yeah, it is. Because it's snowing when it's really cold like this, 21 degrees. Yeah, dude, this is this is awesome, and, and my car just cuts through it like butter. I know, like you're so butter. Lucky. Isn't it nice, dude? Yeah. <laughs> the snow dude. gives me anxiety because oh. I always have, I've always had to just, like figure out how I'm gonna get around. <laughs> yeah, dude. You know? Yeah, man. Because that two wheel drive. But if if you had four wheel drive, you'd be fine driving. Either. Oh yeah, I love. Yeah. I would, it's so much fun. I'd be driving like I did on Valentine's Day. Uh, Valentine's Day was perfect because there was plenty of water. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no snow. It was all God, water. There was so much water that Wasn't day. Wasn't it so weird that yeah. it was just? Like, it was a lot, dude. I mean, I felt like Big Bear was gonna wash away. Dude, right? Right. <laughs> that that was by far the biggest storm I've seen in the four years I've been here. Yeah, it's me too. Water wise. Yeah. Dude, look at all this, bro. Guys, are you guys seeing how deep this is? Like, I really hope you can actually, you're able to tell from this damn video. And we're almost to Kevin's place. All right. Wow, this is amazing, guys. This is so pretty. And the only reason why I'm, I'm, I'm holding it is because, oh wait, I gotta keep that on or else that part's gonna freeze again. Uh oh. Unfortunately. Are it? these paved roads? Is this a paved Oh yeah. It oh, is? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh wow. Dude, holy snow, bro. <laughs> Seriously. You gotta stay on top of it, man. Dude. What's up, brother? So my homie needed a, a, up, a ride What's home that? from work. Scott, Kevin, Kevin, Scott. How's it going? Nice What's to meet you. And I was nice like, dude, up. he lives in, in fucking Irwin. And I'm like, are you? I was like, fuck. Mm -hmm. All right. So I was like, shit, if, if I'm going this way, I'm not going to let you fucking pass oh, up. So. Dude, thanks, man. No problem. No Save problem. I fucking love you, brother. Love you too, man. You have a good night. Yep, try safe in this right, day, Dude, I'm loving it, man. <laughs> oh, fun, right? Yeah, dude, it's so great. I love Subarus. It, it, dude, it's, dude, it's the greatest, man. It's the greatest. And hey, give my love to your mom and dad, please. Of course, man. All right, Kev. All right, Take care, brother. Later. I like him a lot. He's, 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 he's a neat, neat, neat guy. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I actually know him through through his father. I worked with his dad. Oh, you did? At Bear um, as as a cook. His dad is actually a rocket scientist who worked for um, the Jet Propulsion Laboratory, JPL, and he's retired, but he likes to like, to get out for like a, a few months and do some work like that. Oh. Yeah, it's super cool. Wow. Yeah. Hmm. Dude, dude, look at, look at these fresh, hey Scott, do you mind if I just do one thing real quick? No, go ahead, get out. Can you maybe yeah. like, 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 like point this at, or, or wait here? You, you know want what? Me to get out? Well, yeah, get out. I just want to show them Let's how see. how deep these tire marks are. Yeah. Just so they can, like. Dude. Dude. I mean, that's deep. Yeah, it's so pretty. That is so pretty. Oh. That's 
really pretty. And you can vape in here. That's fine. Oh, are you sure? Yeah, I'm just not okay. about cigarettes. Oh, no, me neither. I hate cigarettes. Oh, that's... Ugh. When, when you, were, you were talking about smoking, I uh, thought you... you oh, know? no. <laughs> cigarettes are nasty. I don't think I... I smoked cigarettes since I was 17. Oh, shit. That's a long I'm, I'm going to be, I think, 32. Wow, bro. <laughs> I think that's how old I Man, am. you are old, bro. I know. <laughs> I am. I am. I feel like I'm oh, 25 man. now. Oh, wow. You're the first one in these ones. First what? First one in this, in this uh, snow. So, oh, yeah. Yep. We are making the fresh tracks in this eight inches of new snow right here, guys. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? And it's just no problem. We're just cutting through like nothing. Oh my gosh, seriously, this is just amazing, you guys. This video is going to be so long, but it's going to be so worth it for them to see just how incredibly beautiful this is and the risks that I take. But, <laughs> like, they totally understand. That's another reason why they're always sending me money and um, uh -huh. they, they, like, send me stuff to my mailbox like cash in the mail stuff too really? like, oh dude dude it's these guys are awesome and like typically once i get the cash from the mailbox i'll go to the gas station i'll videotape me handing the gas station guy cash uh -huh. videotape me putting the gas in so they know i'm not like yeah, mis yeah. misappropriating the funds and i think that's why you're so good yeah and that's why a lot of people like i respect that. them yeah yeah and and they freaking realize that and every live chat dude these people donate a ton of money. Yesterday's live chat was like a hundred bucks for like 40 minutes, or like 30 minutes. Like, it, dude, it's, it's, it's just awesome. And I'm going to do the best I can for these guys, you, you know, as, as yeah. they deserve it. That's nice. Yeah, man. They, That's all slush, huh? That's, all That's slush. like icy slush. Yeah. Cause it's, it's cold out here. Yeah. It is cold outside. <laughs> 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 You're missing a light there, buddy. Uh -huh. oh, oh, he's like, no, not anymore. Not <laughs> now it looks normal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, guys, we're heading to Irwin Lake to take Mr. Scott home. Thank you, Nick. Oh, you're very welcome, my friend. Um, and I just hope that my uh, my friends here on YouTube hit you up when they're at Peppercorn Grill. Yeah, definitely. You guys all come in. Come in and see me. If you guys are hungry from uh, Long Down the Mountain, Need a cocktail, martini, we got it. <laughs> Dang straight. Dang straight. <laughs> or, a, or a flat iron steak, we oh. got it. Flat iron filet mignon, oh. some lobster kale. Oh. Oh. Just ask, ask them when you make your reservation that you want to be seated with Scott. Yes, I'll take care of everyone. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> I'll do my best. And, yeah, Scott's, Scott's the shit, you guys. He really is. He's cool as hell. So Thanks, you guys Nick. will definitely be treated well. Yeah, absolutely, dude. Absolutely. Yeah, it looks like a lot less snow over here. Huh? Oh, just wait till we get to your house, dude. Maybe there's my it, path, dude, huh? there's gonna be hardly any snow over there. I know. Well, it's so weird. I don't mean hardly any, but see, so when your brakes lock up like that, even on Those that little slope, sliding. yep. Yeah. Huh? You, you you gotta let go. Yeah. And I and I try to teach my peeps here that that's very very important. Once your brakes lock up, don't panic and start turning the wheel. And stuff let go and unfortunately you're, you're you're gonna gather more speed but you're gonna have a chance to tap your brakes again without the blocking exactly. and, and I, um, I, I I gave them a lesson earlier on Moon Ridge or up in upper Moon Ridge earlier today on a very steep steep slope that was icy to show them how to drive on it and um, yeah I, 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 I like to help them out to keep them safe yeah and they totally dig it uh, so, so what services uh, do you use for uh, tracking the weather and stuff like that? So my favorite weather app that I use out of all of them, and I have about nine on my phone, may I have oh, it? I believe it. The weather, <laughs> the weather Channel app. Oh, does that work the best? That's the one for me that's been most accurate. accurate. But, but the thing is, Scott, is that all of them run off of two main radars. Mm -hmm. So like how, the, how these forecasts can be so different sometimes is mind-boggling. But yeah. like, yeah, like totally mind boggling. So, and then look at this dude. They're having the chain control point way up here. A, a lot closer. What are all those cars parked? Oh, wow. Jeez, dude. There's a lot of people just bumming right now. I hope everyone's okay. I don't, oh shit. Oh, sh looks like someone's over on the side there. I hope yeah. everyone's okay. Oh, oh, oh look at this blizzard over here, bro. Woo. Welcome to Irwin. <laughs> yeah, 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 totally. <laughs> And it, it actually looks like they got a little bit of snow over here. This just looks like more... Oh, 
We'll see though once you once you hop out of the so remind yeah. me, I don't know where uh, Oh yeah, yeah, you're good. You can keep going. Alright, and then I don't mind if everybody knows where I live, I don't care. Alright. I really don't mind. Trust me, <laughs> they're they're all super cool. Yeah. They all know where I live because I start off all my videos from my house every time, mm -hmm. pretty much, so they all know. You guys can come find me. <laughs> <laughs> find them at Peppercorn. <laughs> And I'm telling you guys, like you guys will be super stoked on on the service. And uh, this guy, he deserves big ass tips because he's a really, really, really freaking cool dude. Aww, and please dang. take please take care of my friends as I as I make sure they take care of you guys. I always Thanks, do. Nick. And Scott's gonna take care of you guys, right? Yes, most big definitely. time. You guys come and see me, and we will definitely work something out. <laughs> well, look at this, yeah, dude. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. This looks like a uh, Wow. Sure. You got a little bit of snow over here, bro. Yeah. It looks I'll bet cool. Boulder Bay has a foot to a foot and a half right now, guarantee you. I'm going to go over there yeah. after this like an idiot and add it to the end of this video. Are you? Yep. Yeah. That'll yep. be good. Oh, yeah, dude. You can cover the whole valley. Oh, uh, dude. Well, that's what I do. Pretty much. <laughs> that, that's what I do, man. Yeah, good. Yeah. It's cool, cool, man. So where was your mansion again? Next one. Next one? Gosh, yeah. look how deep it was over here. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, left. Dude, that is so cool, dude. It wow. Like really picked. We, this was a pretty good storm. Yeah, Heck right yeah. Pretty good storm. Really good storm. Make the fresh tracks right here. Yeah. Dude, this is awesome. What happened? It looks like they were walking. Oh, and this is going to be my house right here on the left. And if you want, Which one? you can pull Oh, yeah, yeah. Right you can pull, yeah. That's right, right that's right. Just like this. I remember seeing yeah. your truck just like that. And then I can leave straight ahead like that, right? Yeah, yeah. Dude, you are the best, dude. Sure, definitely. You are the best, man. Well, thank you, Nick. I appreciate it. Thanks, may, to all the viewers. May they say goodbye to you. I'll see you guys later. Come and see me on the peppercorn once again. I'll be there. No. <laughs> I'll be there. Scott the shit, you guys. All right. Dude, we'll hey, see you later, hey, hey, man, you have a great night, okay? Yeah, thank you. You're Hit very me welcome. Tomorrow. All right, dude. We'll be in touch. All right, brother. Keep, okay. up, keep up the good work, man. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. You have a good night. Too, All right. right? I will hit you up tomorrow. Okay, it sounds good. All right, Bye, dude. Nick. Bye. What a cool guy, man. What a cool, cool, cool guy. All right. All righty. Now we are out of here. Look at how deep the snow is. This is awesome, guys. This phone's going to overheat in a moment. Whoa, what was that that I just ran over? Who did I run over? Guys, this is almost, this is like almost a foot deep. I'm telling you, this is deep. And when we get over to Boulder Bay, that's going to be sick. I got to do it, guys. That's just part of what I do. Anyway, I love you. Peace out for now. We're going to turn this on once we get back over to the other side of town. So this video is not too intensely long. Love you guys so much, man. Peace out. So just real quick, this is in between Division and Stanfield Cutoff. It's just got really, really gusty, and uh, it almost became whiteout conditions for a second right here. There's accidents all over town, you guys. Um, I feel really horrible for a lot of these people, dude. It's so cold outside, too. 22 degrees. Snow coming down like crazy. Um, and the snow's like champagne powder, though, guys. It's like the Rocky Mountain type of snow because it's very cold and dry right now. So anyway, take care. You're the best, you guys. I'm going to turn this back on once we get over to Boulder Bay because I want to see how much snow they have right now at nighttime. All right, guys. So this is the continuation video of the video I just did. We went to Irwin to take Scott home from Peppercorn Grill. He didn't have a ride home tonight, and I'm not going to let anybody suffer like that. Guys, there's no way. So I took my boy home. And we're going to be hitting a lot of fresh snow over here, guys. And parts of town already have a foot of snow. Biggest storm we've had so far, guys, in terms of snow. It's so cool, man. It's so cool. I had to stop and get some hot cocoa for this drive. <laughs> yes. Yes. Hot cocoa. Yes. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And the lake looks amazing right now. It's just covered in white. The whole thing looks white. So if you didn't know there was a lake there, you might walk out on it and be doomed. Be doomed, yes. Yes, be doomed. Yes. And we're not getting much traffic over here. Um, 
I'm just very, very excited, and uh, I guess it shows. You guys hear that? I think that's my tire rubbing. There's a lot of snow and ice shoved up in shoved up into the crevices of my vehicle. Hey, that sounded pretty sexy. <laughs> slow it down, slow it down, 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 down. Now, here we go. Well, that is the coolest sound. It sounds like a rocket ship. Like a spaceship, man. See, we're taking up both sides because we want, we want to drive as safe as we possibly can. There's nobody out here right now. We'd be able to see them coming from a long way away except for around this turn, but you'd still be able to see them. This turn always catches people off guard. Like this guy is flying up here. What are you doing, dude? I, sh I, I want to flash my brights at him, but I don't want to blind him even more. No, he, he just totally slowed down, good. I'm gonna keep my eye on him to make sure he doesn't go over the edge right there. Because then we got to turn around right away. So what would you guys do if you saw that? First thing you would do, first thing I would do is immediately call the police and then turn around and Say a command. exit. I wasn't even talking to her. She's so nosy. She is so absolutely nosy. In the middle of a conversation, she'll just be like, hey, say a command. I'm getting jealous that you're talking to other people. She's jealous of me. Oh shit. Did you guys see see that car right there it's completely in the, in the ditch there are two two people right there we're just gonna turn around and see if they need any more assistance okay the car was like upside down holy shit hang on how am i gonna turn around holy shit guys that was insane the car was completely like on its side in in the ditch to the right so we just gotta go and make sure that everything's okay. Uh, I'm break my windows, trying to roll them down right now because it's so cold. Okay, guys, take a look at this. Look, look, look at this Jeep. Straight ahead, it's on its side. Look at that, guys, on its side right there. Holy shit. Let's just ask them. Okay, all right. Thank you. That's, that's freaking gnarly, dude. Yeah. Okay, all right, guys. Thank you. Bye. Oh, my God, dude. Okay, they're okay. Thank God. Oh, my God, thank God. So, we're going to turn around. That was hectic, guys. That was scary. I don't like seeing that. I don't like seeing that. I think this might be police and ambulances coming up right now. It's someone going fast as hell. Oh, dude, he's losing control. No, what an idiot. I sound like some of the mean people talking to me. Okay. Wow, dude, there's a lot of new snow, folks. So, yeah, keep an eye out over here to the left so you can see that, that Jeep completely on its side in the ditch. That is so sad. I really hope everyone's okay. As you guys can see, there's no fire trucks, police cars, ambulances, nothing over here. But I stopped to make sure they uh, they were okay, and she said they're all good. So we'll just, oh my God, this is horrible, guys. Look at this. Oh my God, that's just horrible. God. People come up here to have a good time, and that and that kind of stuff can happen. I'm, I'm so sorry about that. That's just, that's just heartbreaking, you guys. I'm so sorry. Oh, man. That just makes me want to just drive slower and, you know. But those are those turns up here that if you don't see them coming, you're in trouble. Because you can't slam on your brakes. Because you can't do it. You guys hear that? That's my tires rubbing.
Now, if we hit a good dip in the road, it'll probably shake all that ice loose, and, and that sound will be done. Be done with. But guys, it's really dumping right now, man. And the further we go this way, the more snow we're going to get. So this is cool, cool, cool. We're doing the Bear Valley Tour. We're heading into Sugarloaf right now. Or <laughs> Fawn Skin right now. Twenty degrees, guys. Twenty degrees. Ten forty-seven p.m. And uh, yeah, Holcomb Valley. If you make a right, we'll get to Holcomb right over there. But guys, this is nuts. This is nutty, and I'm on both sides of the road. I'm driving in the very, very middle because we want to be safe. There's nobody coming, so why wouldn't we do this, right? If we lose control on this kind of curve going to the left, then we have plenty of room to slide across to the right. Now we're not going to do that right here because if we slide to the left, we'll be sliding into oncoming traffic and we don't want to do that. But there are certain parts of the road that you can fully take advantage of the whole road in this type of weather. And since you technically can't see a lane, I don't know how they can give you any ticket for it. Just play dumb. Fonskin guys, we'll be in downtown Fonskin in no time, and then we'll be out of downtown Fonskin in even no less in lesser time. <laughs> so funny this guy thinks he is, huh? Man, it's just a wonderland over here. Winter Wonderland, yes? Oh yes, my friend, yes, winter, winter, winter. This drive in the morning is gonna be spectacular. We're gonna slow down. Slow down. Um, regarding road conditions guys highway 38 r3 conditions i hope you guys figure that or you know what i'm going to post a little part of that first ahead of this video because i forgot to mention it at the start and i just mentioned it like 20 30 minutes into the video so don't want to be like that anyway r3 conditions right now must have chains on all vehicles no exceptions it said traction devices on all vehicles, no exceptions. And if you look up the definition of R3 conditions, what does it say? Traction, um, traction devices on all vehicles, no exceptions. R2 conditions, it says traction devices on, on all, all vehicles except for four wheel drive and all wheel drive. Sorry, there you go. We just kind of lost a little bit there for a second, but we're all good in the hood. We're all hood in the good. Oh man, that hot chocolate is so good. It's orgasmic. Oh, Hershey's, oh God, oh, Hershey's, oh. <laughs> Whoa. 
Look at all the snow over here, you guys. This is absolutely astonishing. It's just beautiful, though. It's, like, it's beautiful. It's very, very beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it's really, really incredibly pretty over here. Man, absolutely gorgeous. I'll take this off its holster because it's getting warm again. Take a look over there. What do we see? Oh, no. So now we're about to enter the downtown Fonskin area. Don't blink, as I always say, because it will pass you by. And we passed it. I'm just kidding. We're coming up to it right now. And it looks like everything in the town is off. All the lights are off for the most part. That's, it's kind of weird that it's really this dark. I'm not used to it being this dark at 10.52 p.m. Wow, guys, this is the deepest snow we've been driving in uh, since we've been doing videos this season. Not right here, but just this storm. This is awesome. It was short and quick. It's not over yet, but it was short and quick. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, excuse me. So we're out of Fonskin now. We're heading back over by the Big Bear Dam, and then uh, that, that's the part of the town that gets the most snow. So I'm looking forward to seeing how much snow they got over there. As you can see, we're making some fresh triggity tracks up in this mud. So that's cool. I mean, there's some track, but we're uh, tracking over a bunch of the older tracks, so there haven't been too many vehicles on this road recently, which is nice. Oh, except we got right in front of us. <laughs> Spoke too soon, didn't I? Oh, thanks, brother. That's so, that's so, so cool of him. I had to give him the old flashers to tell him thank you. Because that's what you do. When people drive like champs like that, and they're considerate, you, you consider it right back to them. That's what we do, yo. Wow, this snow is getting deep. on the right there look like they gave up <laughs> dude this is just sick so we gotta turn this up again because it's getting cold out there oh blizzard oh! sweet I mean, this is truly intense right now. This is awesome. I haven't seen it like this in forever. And as I said, we're just cutting through like butter. It's pretty amazing to me, actually, how easy this is. Here's the lake to the left. Uh, I know you guys can't see it, but just, just awesome to see this storm just hammering, hammering away. Be careful about getting too close to the side because these ditches 
will grab you and pull you in. It's, it's horrible. I've come close a few times. They just grab onto your tires and pull you right in. You'll think you're still on the road because you can't see the edge of the road. But right when you hit that edge, it'll pull you right into the ditch, so just be careful. Man, this is awesome, guys. Woo! The depths of the snow. See, now we're getting close to the edge. We need to not get close to the edge. Look at this guy. He's buried up, up to his tires. Or up to the freaking bumper. That was cool. I had more hair on my head. <laughs> Where did that come from? Because I wanted to dye my hair. I used to always dye my hair all different colors all the time. And then I'd bleach it out, then I'd shave it, and then re dye it, or, and then bleach it, or bleach it, and then dye it. It was just a never ending process. Uh oh. So, yeah, we're on North Shore driving through some deep snow right now, almost to the Big Bear Dam. And I can tell it's like. It's given my car kind of, not an issue, but it's letting my car know that the snow is deep. Track with caution. Cross track with caution. I know I'm giving Subaru such good publicity for this thing. So they should like hook me up with a car. They really should. Or pay for this for me. That'd be cool. Guys, look at these fresh tracks. Look, we're making them. We really are. Woo, that was cool. Before the snow plows arrive, everything, guys. That's awesome. The snow came down so fast, so heavy, that uh, the snow plows kind of were overwhelmed, like you, you could definitely say. So, could down there, Sam. Wow. Wow, was If I had snow tires, dude, like, when I had my Mercedes ML 500, when I had the regular, well, they weren't regular, they were low profile tires because I had big ass rims on there. Those things got around in the snow, no problem. And then I bought the very expensive BF Goodrich all-terrain tires, the ones that just looked like monsters, and my car looked, didn't track as well. It was weird. Like, I thought spending a fortune on those tires would make it better for the car, but it wasn't. It sure wasn't. Guys, this is really deep snow here. Look at all these cars to the left, just buried. I mean, not buried, you know, but for us this season, this is a good snow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Man, I thought that was gonna be a lot rougher than that. Ooh, I was bracing. I was bracing. Yes, yeah, so this is gonna be a long ass video, but you guys are gonna get to see a lot of good snow. And parts of town where there's hardly any snow. But then again, Irwin had a bunch of snow, didn't they, guys? They didn't they? But Irwin's kind of at the bottom of those mountains right there, too, so they can get it. It was Baldwin that we didn't really check out much of today. I kind of dropped the ball on that, didn't I? I guess we could drive all the way back over there right now. I'll, I'll have to see. Okay, so we're at the dam. We're at the dam, the, the John Claude Van Dam, and uh, it just looks beautiful out here. Look at we're making the total fresh tracks, and it is kind of deep. Woo! Look at that, guys. I mean, do you want to see how deep it is here? We're gonna go right, even though we're uh, it's closed. They have it totally closed off over here. We're gonna go right and then I'm gonna just go behind the car real quick we're pulled off to the side so you don't have to worry I'm gonna go behind the car real quick so you guys can see how deep the tire marks are 
from what we just did. did. I mean, that's not that deep, I, I guess, because there's still a lot more. Oh yeah, dude, there's so much more down here. Dude, way deeper. It's just piled in and, and just socked down. So, yeah. Very cool though, very cool. It's so nice seeing this road like this, just completely empty because it's closed off up there. Let's flip around. Woohoo! They even have this light off. I mean, there's really no point in, in having the light on when there's no traffic coming through. Oops, slow down there. There, come on, there we go. So this is the way you guys typically come into town, but this way is closed down. So there's not gonna be too much traffic or too many tire marks over here, but you do see them. People going back over to Fonski in that direction. So, so far the most snow I've seen this storm was up in Sugarloaf and in parts of Boulder Bay, which is right here to the left. And then Irwin came in number three so far, guys. Pretty surprising. Well, just look at all this snow straight ahead. Just beautiful. This hot chocolate is so good. Oh my gosh. Just unbelievably good. Oh yeah. Gosh, there's so much snow over here. Reckless he is. He's driving one-handed. What a crazy guy. He should, nobody should watch him and condone that behavior. Fuck yourself. All right, so, yes, I just did say that. So, um, let's see here. Oh yeah. Yeah, good luck without all-wheel drive or four-wheel drive in town, you guys. Good luck. Nice and quick, oh yeah. Woo -hoo. That was fun. It's kind of fun to drive out here when there's no one else out here. Oh, 
Oh shit, here comes somebody. I gotta, oh wait, he's, he's not coming over here. He's just having a hard problem getting somewhere, poor guy. Sucks to be you. He had a four by four truck, I'm sure he's fine. Guys, we got a dumping, holy moly. So we're in Boulder Bay now, and yeah, you can tell they got freaking nailed over here. Ooh, nailed. Ooh, nailed. It's so nice out here. It just stopped snowing. And the clouds have ascended again. And you can see a long distance down here. It's so nice. I wish I could be playing music right now, but it'll block the video worldwide. It's so stupid. It used to only like say, oh, your video won't be monetized. And that's it. But it would still allow it to play. Like, that's all I care about. I, I don't mind giving credit to these people. I don't care. Like, they deserve it. Whatever. I'm happy to hook them up. in front of us that's cool to see we got some guy walking in the middle of the road that's cool to see he looks drunk I hope he's okay you know what is he drunk or is he just because I don't want to misjudge somebody for being drunk when they actually have hypothermia or something because uh, we don't want anybody dying out here it's really cold I'm wondering what that guy was doing out there there's no bars over there maybe he walks to the liquor store but I think they're closed Anyway, guys, we're trekking nicely. Oh, oh, we're about to come up to these mofos up here. Oh, yeah. It really does sound like a spaceship. Woohoo! This is so awesome. This is so awesome. Woohoo! This road is bumpy right now, huh? Because of all the snow. I have to take the phone off of its holster so it doesn't jump around like that. It's amazing, guys. We filled up the tank yesterday and we need to fill it up again. That's how much gas I use doing these freaking videos. That's insane, huh? At that rate, that's 55 a day, 110. Wow, man. Wow, dude. That's like, like 400 bucks a week. That's okay. Plus the 25 cents extra mile per mile that I go over on my lease. That's okay. It's worth it, you guys. It's totally worth it. Alright guys, so I'm going to shut the video off right about in a couple seconds when we pull into the post office because i got to get my mail. And then I'm going to post this and then I have a thank you post to do for a Venmo transfer. I appreciate it, dude. I already thanked him personally through uh, some back and forth commenting. Appreciate you, dude. I'll do you a personal video in just a little bit. Love you guys very much. Thank you for cruising around with me. I know this is a long, long video, but I really appreciate you hanging out with me. It's 20 degrees, 11, 11 p.m. Um, yeah, 
just having me on in in the background guys that's that's just freaking gotta be cool and is this person taking a piss i don't know what they were doing but they were looking in that in that ditch like they were like they found a dead body or something guys we're almost here to the post office let's get a little loose on this left turn what do you think huh? I don't see any cars to the left so let's do it Woo! oh yeah <laughs> oh yeah wow we got loose easy there huh that was pretty easy it's so easy when nothing seems to please me it all feels alright So come with me. Don't ask me where because I don't know. Okay, so we're about to enter the post office. I wish this thing wouldn't bounce like that. That's really irritating. I guess it does that for a reason so it doesn't snap when it does hit rough spots but we're gonna pull into the post office right now and I'm gonna let you guys go till next time folks peace in the Middle East deepage there's some deepage here peace guys